Mau tahu berita menarik lainnya? Jangan lupa nyalakan lonceng notifikasi dan subscribe YouTube Medcom ID. Your songs are big on social media. What's your perspective about social media life, particularly related to the mental health of adolescents? I, that, I, that's a beautiful question. Um, I'm very grateful for social media because it gives me a platform to be able to show my music and I would not be where I am without it. And I'm very grateful. It's social media is like kind of like a double edged sword, you know, like you have the positivity that comes from it and it's great and it can be really helpful for your career and just what you're doing and the music making. But then also you have people that are going to see you as a character and not a real human being and say things about you, make up rumors and make up lies and say things that aren't true and assume things about you. And it's, you know, and that can be really difficult to know how to handle. And, you know, you can, people can really say like very cruel things when they don't know anything about you or they don't do any research about you. They just see one thing online that they read once and they already made an opinion of it about you, you know? Um, and so it's like, it, I love everything. I love the platform, being able to talk to people, being able to connect with people and like show off it. But then, you know, there can be things that negatively affect your mental health because people can be in a lot of pain and they don't know how to process that. And sometimes, you know, hurt people hurt people. And so they want to hurt your feelings. And some people will literally go out of their way to say bad things about you and like not say positive things about you and i think that's a very normal normal thing on the internet is like where the love you get you will also get hate that comes with it yeah. and um so it's definitely been a thing to try and figure out because also like i started doing social media because i did music you know that was a way to show people the music that i make the way i make music and just my personality and like just who i am as a person trying to like put myself out there but it wasn't an easy and natural thing to do i didn't know how to make TikToks. i don't know how that worked that was not a natural i wasn't like okay i'm gonna make my tick like i wasn't like doing TikTok, and that's when i started doing music you know and like even instagram like knowing how to take a picture of yourself that was weird i don't know pictures i wanted to be posting of me and like i wanted to also figure out how to still feel like me while doing things that didn't feel like me it didn't feel like me to like try and record myself but it felt like me showing off an original song and me singing in my bathroom about it you know or showing off a demo that i'm excited about and it felt like me to post about the pizza that i was excited about eating or a photo that i like kind of felt like a baddie in you know like and so it's definitely been a process but i'm very grateful for it overall and um i definitely think the media can be a positive thing for yeah. your mental health if, if you let it, but also can be really negative. And so it's just to know how much to let it affect you and let it affect the way you view yourself as a person. Bubur ayam, kalau diaduk-aduk jadi cair. <laughs> Medcom.id, a part of Media Group News.